You guys remember to stay hydrated, okay? Fellas, how are we all doing tonight? I uh, hope we're all doing well. Hope we're all doing solid. Hope we all had a good weekend. Uh, yeah, things were busy this weekend, so I didn't get to do the Sunday stream. I just got pretty tired and was just kind of like there. So apologies for no Sunday stream. Uh, but we're here. We're here for Monday stream. Tonight we're going to be doing some more Final Fantasy XIV. Um, 
Quest is getting good at the moment. We're currently in what's basically Texas. Um, it's good fun. Probably some more um, fetch quests at the moment. I think we just... Sag knows Sunday stream. I'm sorry, boy. I mean, we were there for games night, but it was just like, eh. Pretty tired for stream. You know. It's just one... It was one of those days I was just like... There's too much that's going on this weekend. I'm just like, I want nap. I want nap. But anyway, we're here for MSQ. Um, there'll probably be a few more fetch quest story, um, usual narration scenario. Um, yeah, that's about it. Let's get to it. And we're in. Cool. That looks weird because I did not load it. Uh, all right. Quest. While well, we wait, we should uh, we should get, we could get started to moving the timber somewhere more accessible. It shouldn't take long if we split the work. Uh, did I? Yay! Time to kill more of it. No. <laughs> Step down the hallway saying yes. <laughs> He doesn't know the context. Nor would I let him know. Alright, let's get the volume back up. Um, is this alright for audio? Just slightly more. Maybe. Might get too loud at some point, but we'll see. All right, Timber. You'll have two minutes to complete the task. Should you fail, return to the... Oh, what? Huh? Oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck off. You ain't getting me. What a thrill. You ain't catch me, lithered. I got boxes to take with me. Her. Her. We got this. Fellas, we did it. We carried the box. <laughs> It was a good box. I think this should. I think this would be. It should be enough. That was mighty kind of you to move all that lumber. Uh, sorry, you didn't make it back sooner. Ah, oh, what were these guys' voices again? We'll see to the rest. Mm-hmm. Once we repaired the tracks. Uh, we'll have you on the first train out of town. Ain't that right, Chief? Oh, I gotta go back to the Texas accent. Er, uh, as much as I'd like to make it so, there aren't any spots available. You'll have to wait for the one after, I'm afraid. But you'll be riding free of charge. It's the least we can do to repay your kindness. That's fine. Now, Mika and a few, I know a few others were here long before we arrived. It's only right they go for us. Yeah. That's true, they've been waiting. I hope you'll stop by and see the train off. It's a breathtaking sight, let me tell you. And need a week as we'll be driving. No engineer compares to her. And it's always a treat to watch her work. The only work we should be doing is our own, Shenza. And we've still got more to do. I'll find somewhere quiet, to, quiet near the station to pass the time. If there's anything else in uh, in Shalawani to your kin to see, I'll leave you up to it. Oh, sweet. So that's it. We're done here. We're about to do more stuff. I thought I was still carrying the box. <laughs> I got scared. Shiba time! Oh, walk. 
Which one's the... There it is. Ride Shiva! <laughs> Fuck, that's a bush! Ah! <laughs> that's the wrong button as well. I took a screenshot. <laughs> I figured it out. Don't worry. Alright. Where are we off to again? A... Talking to Aaron Bill? Yeah. Erinville. How do you feel of the sights? They appear to they appear to have almost finished. Several cutscenes, let's go! The correct time to end stream last time. And now we sit here, grab some popcorn, and watch a train go. My ears. A glorious grand machine indeed. I hope Namika was able to secure a seat. Here she comes. I can finally send you some images after this. <laughs> For people's reference, Kaifalos has, has since finished the expansion. And he's been waiting for me for so long. And by so long, I mean probably two days? Ish? Yeah? Thanks A bit to more? You, we managed to resume service much faster than anticipated. You have our gratitude. You're welcome. <sighs> Nothing so enchanting as a cerulean-powered engine in motion. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Don't think I'll ever tire of watching them chugging along. It's three and a bit. <sighs> Fuck, you've been counting. Oh. <laughs> and so long as we can lay the tracks, she can go on and on and on. Before you know it, she'll be crossing the entire continent. Damn. Railroads are a somewhat recent addition to Tural. As it stands, we can only ferry folks as far as Yasolani. Cool. And from an operational standpoint, we still have much to learn. There's always some problem or another to deal with. Mm -hmm. But we'll keep working at it. We'll hone our craft and continue expanding till one day our trains are running coast to coast. That's the ultimate dream. Kill. Now we just Goodness, chat. I completely lost track of time. By now, I expect the train will be nearing Yasolani. Cool. When it returns, we'll see you on your way. So if you've got any preparations to make, you better make them quick. Where are they going? Not another one? You can't be serious. I was getting dog. Um. I am Monsoon. <laughs> so, what just happened? Gods have mercy. What? Is that the fucking ball in LA? What in the flying? What's happening? <laughs> no. Natobikwe and the others. <laughs> you didn't just dodge one in the flying well. fuck. We're going to investigate right now. 
Uh, are we on on foot? Whoa, what the fuck? This is a Dr. Eggman type skit. The Imperial March begins, yeah. We need to get back right away. Please, Aaronville, just like pull out like a 50 cal or something for this fight. I know you're just a gleaner, but I mean, come on. Just rack a chamber or something. I don't know. Heavens for Fent. You're here. Good. Good. They came from the sky and attacked without any warning. <laughs> Surely a gun or two in there, yeah. The people need our help. Surely like a grand. I don't know. I don't know. Getting killed by Tron? that <laughs> your soul is mine what did it just do Jaja <laughs> turnaround in like five minutes <laughs> well it should have been five minutes anyway I'll hold the line here fall back to the palace quickly before it's overrun bet thank you Bakul Jaja leg it Please, instance where we play as Bakul Jaja right now, please. This is simply how I do things now. So, who wants to take my black cat? 
Damn. <laughs> that would have been cool. Who are you? Hello, person with not really Tulihiola like clothing. Seems kind of neat. How are we doing? Yes, Genesect. <laughs> that you should still live. Zoracha? By the god. <laughs> he has become <laughs> Arbiter <laughs> Halo. <laughs> Is simple the dissolution of Tuli Yolal and surrender of all its territories. Refuse, and I will kill every last one of you. Wow, okay. Have you gone mad? No, my ambition remains unchanged. To teach the masses the folly of war, that they cry out for peace, and thus unite the world. What has changed you so much, and in so short a time? To harm the very people you swore to serve. This is an unforgivable deed, committed by my son. My son! Should he be one to do this? No. His sins are mine to bear. Fear not. Osoralja is strong. He has never been father's equal in combat. You say that, but I think we know what's coming. I believed you long dead. To have the chance to kill you myself is an unforeseen blessing. Okay, I press my hide command and then whoop in the back.
parry break. Farewell, Sir Ultra, my son. And forgive me. Oh, damn. He's going to get back up. Self res? What? How? Despite his old age, the mighty Gulul Jaja remains a fearsome foe indeed. You retain the vitality of two souls despite the passing of one. Oh, I shall even the odds. That's cool. <laughs> I am. Papa? Oh fuck, they went it in completely with it. Do it. You are no match for me. Murderer on my honor has vowed a resolve. I'll make you pay. So the once faint-hearted girl would live up to her title. Very well. If only to demonstrate the disparity between us, I give you a chance to prove yourself. Rally the entirety of your strength. Lay siege to my kingdom. Strike me down, like I did father. Then, will you be his worthy successor? Is this just Virgil if he was a scaly? <laughs> Man, each pose that they do for like the camera shots, it's more and more giving the argument that yes, that is just Arbiter. <laughs> yeah, Jono, you're completely right. <laughs> See there as well! <laughs>
Where's the res mages? Did we get it? No. Damn. Alrighty. Um, Alright, there is an ad that's about to come up, so I'm going to start that now, and then we'll continue. But yeah, damn. Um, that was some good animation. I that was that was cool. That was really cool. Um, they've definitely stepped up stepped up a lot. Oh, he's still alive. I think he's breathing. He's there. Um. But yeah, they've really stepped it up. I'm very glad that um, they're still making improvements to, like, you know, what they can accomplish with cutscenes and stuff. Um, it's doing good for the storytelling, and it does make it, like, a lot more interesting. Um, yeah, that's all I've got at the moment. <laughs> Um, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, I have more cooldowns on Hotza. I need to move that off. There we go. Cool. Just hide that for now. Hide the map. All right. Let's continue. No. Papa can't die. He can't. Happy music. <laughs> okay, no time for tears. How? How could this happen? More cutscene? Yep. <laughs> Voiced? Seeming like. Please, you can't give up. Are you there, oh friend? Oh man, <laughs> they all step right back. Here. I'm right here. Look after my children. What? I'm an old fossil like you. I've only got so many years left. But if that's what you want, it would be an honor. You and I must go on another journey together someday. Hi, you can count on it. Yes, Papa. The graves of the Yokui. You saw them, yes? 
I always found their teachings comforting. <coughs> Please, Father, you must save your strength. Our flesh may wither and die, but so long as we are remembered, we are never truly gone. Through you, my hopes survive. Through you, I live on. So do not mourn me. Walk tall and see our nation to a brighter future. Rip Gulu Jaja. Are you sevens in chat? Right. So, uh, I. Val Wuklamat, Val Kuana. I bring word from the city. The enemy has withdrawn, and the lands guard have begun rendi rendering aid to the people. Casualties within our ranks have hindered progress, but we continue to do all we can. I thank you for the report. Please inform the guard they are to prioritize such efforts until further notice. The people. I need to help them. We will assist you in whatever way we can, of course. Thank you, thank you. There are sure to be wounded everywhere, more than I could count. We'll split up and help all of them. You can count on us. Alphinon and Alice, could you take Bayside Bevy and Kyle and Erinville? Click the palace, the palace perimeter. As for Aaron, please come to the resplendent quarter with me. We'll all meet back here afterwards. Yup. Mm hmm. And running, running, and running, running, and running, running. By Paula Baron back. What's up? Oh, I can't jump down from there. Great. Oh, wow. The jazz we had is gone. So, oh. Ominous clouds. Okay. Uh, Okapacha. No? Oh, that's side quest. Okay. Uh, helping citizens. Yep, let's do it. Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
I thought I was done for. I heard something disturbing. The enemy leader. They say he looked like Zoral Jaja. Zoral Jaja. Well, that can't be true, can it? Why would the first promise attack his own people? But if it was him, what happens now? Is he going to come back? What do we do if he does? That's not sprint. Aid you. Thank you. The pain is better now, but I can't stop shaking. Where did they come from? Why did they attack us? And why are those things still in the sky? We had peace under Gulu Jaja. We were safe. But now... Yeah, I don't know what's happening, B. I don't know. I do not know. Stop. Interrupted. No. Let me aid. There you go. Th thanks. I think I'm alright. Did you see them? Those soldiers? They looked like people. But they killed and killed with no hesitation. If they attack us again, how can we hope to defend ourselves? And we help you. Thank you, miss. But, but my husband and son, they, they were... Oh. Hmm, where's this last one? There we go. And good soldier. What up? My thanks. I'll be fine now. But we failed to protect the people. Why did so many have to die? Where were Val Luklamat and Val Kalana? Uh, they're not to blame. I understand, I do, but... I need to clear my head. Fair enough, take your ten. Take your ten. Look. Hey, I'm back. You finished dating the people here? Yep. Thank you. There were children among the wounded. Children. No, now isn't the time. There are still others who need help. Could you go and see how things are in Talon March? Afterwards, go and find Alice at Bayside Devi. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. People. Ow. Surveys. What's we got? There is no evidence of significant damage from the battle. Fighting did not spread this far, it seems. Hmm. So they kept the murals up. Zorolja Zer has standards, apparently. The fresh scorch marks on the ground are doubtless from enemy salt. 
Ja. Oh, come on. There we go. The shop appears to have weathered the chaos, though its wares have been strewn across the floor. unscathed, but the enemy ships continue to loom overhead. I don't remember this part in history where the Mayans got um, invaded by stormtroopers. That I don't get. I'd say stormtroopers are supposed to miss, but they didn't have guns. They had swords, and usually they work, so I don't know. I've helped all those I could find, and seen them delivered into the Landsguard's care. As many, ca as many casualties as there are, it would have been worse if the Landsguard hadn't fought as bravely as they did. And if Zoralja actually meant to harm the people, I mean... Look around. The buildings are hardly damaged. I suspect his aim was more to incite fear, to show that he could strike whenever he pleases. But we can discuss that later. How's Lamati? Maybe not handling up that well. Even after what happened to her father, she's trying so hard to fulfill her duty to her people. Still, everyone has their limits. She needs rest, and soon. Someone mentioned seeing her head towards the shore. Perhaps she's gone to the Gonitruk Gleam Sands. Yeah, let's head there. There you are, Lamati. I was beginning to... Come on! Come on! Take it! Please! Oh, man. Lamati... Lamati! You need rest, you and her both. I will tend to this soul. Guard have matters well in hand. Trust in them. If there's another attack, your people will need you to protect them. They'll need you to be sharp. So please rest. Consider it your duty. Yeah.
I stood before them all. Said that we'd build a nation where everyone knows happiness. So much for that promise. What good is a vow of resolve who cannot save her people? Oh. We'll handle this together. You'll stick with me. Mm hmm. Thank you. My head's a little clearer now. I need to concentrate on what I can do rather than what I can't. Exactly. Can only do so much. We've dealt with unfriendly factions before. From Yokuista longing for conquest to adherents of blessed siblings, people who are unwilling to listen. Even so, I believe that by learning about one another and engaging in good faith, we could peacefully settle our differences. And we did. Hmm. My brother is different. There'll be no reasoning with him. He killed our people. Our father. He'll stop at nothing to achieve his goal. What's more, he has power. The power to destroy the peace we've worked so hard to preserve. If I'm to protect that peace, then I must fight. This shot goes hard. <laughs> I must confront Zorolja and kill him. Damn. Go get him, Lama Yi. I'm fine. I just need a mo I just needed a moment to settle my nerves. Thank you for being there for me, and for urging me on despite all my sulking. Sitting around and sitting around complaining isn't very leader-like, is it? So much has happened so quickly. I struggle to make sense of it all. The strange soldiers, those floating ships, the new power Zoral Jal commands. Given everything he's done and still intends to do. I know I cannot afford to run into, run headlong into battle. Not this time. I cannot let this terrible pain in my heart lead me astray. But I will make it my strength. The strength to do what I must. <laughs> yes! Right. I am heading back to the palace. I need to talk strategy with Koana. Could you and the others join us in a while? However... We decide how we decide to proceed. I want you all to be aware of it. Oh, and could you tell Alice I'll be alright? She's probably at the bayside bed, V. Yeah. Ah, oh, fight trot. That was some aftermath, eh? <laughs> I keep thinking I can mount here, that's why I stopped. Um, yeah, Darth Vader went him. Oh, that's a dead one. Oh, you're back. By that, I take it to mean Lamachi is feeling better. She needs to be strong for the people of Tural, I understand that. But she doesn't have to do it alone. So, if she intends to fight, then we fight. Together. Damn straight. That said, I wish I knew exactly what we were up against. True. Hey, level 98, baby. It's clearly not a person, but it doesn't look like any automaton or magitech weapon I've ever seen. 
As far and wide as you've traveled, though, perhaps you've been out at something similar before. Yeah, we played Nier. <laughs> we played Nier in this game. It was fun. Would you mind taking a closer look? It may yield some clues as to Zoraljar's new powers. Examine the fallen soldier. All right, what you got? Uh, phase blaster, fucking coolest thing ever. The general shape of this weapon resembles a gun, but its construction suggests it's far more advanced than anything you've ever seen before. Um, <laughs> maybe. No, I'll be maybe, probably. Corpse. From a distance, it appeared to be a simple to be simple armor, but upon closer inspection, its construction is quite intricate. The material from which it's made on made is unclear, and you see no signs of a power source. No signs of a power source. Huh. In place of where eyes or mouths might be, you see a strange sigil on the front of this helm. A strange sigil. My brother in Heidelin, it's a triangle. <laughs> strange sigil. <laughs> Dude, strange sigil, it could have had the cool S on it. I don't know. That's a triangle. <laughs> I don't know. So, what do you think? It looked like a person, but it's clearly mechanical. Indeed. While it resembles a person, it has features that make it uncanny. The lack of a face, not least of all. Do you see any sign of a power source? I didn't see one close up, no. So it probably doesn't run on ceruleum or any other conventional fuels. I tried channeling ether into it, but... There was no response. That would seem to rule out it rule it out as an arcane entity. It's completely lifeless now. A far cry from the unstoppable enemy it was in battle. Even the material it's made of is a mystery. Rather than metal, it's more akin to stone. Wait, haven't we seen this somewhere recently? Um Yeah, we have, in Sky Deep Sinote. That's right! The glowing stone is used in the chamber with the gate to the Golden City. And while the soldiers are a, diff are a different color, the warships are in the same black... are the same black as the stone of the gate itself. True? True, 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 true. There has to be a connection. Let's share our observations with the others when we gather in the sun at the Sun Perch. Right. The sooner we get to the bottom of this mystery, the better. Bet. All right, let's do it. Ba -da -ba 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 Where are we off to? Up there. I think we're getting to solution nine soon. I'm very hype. It's gonna be cool. Looks like everyone is here is ready. All right, what's the sitch? Thank you for coming, everyone. Yeah. 
What's poppin'? And thank you for taking charge in the relief effort. We would have fared far worse without you. Hmm. Someone had to do it, that's all. Come, let's take stock. In terms of casualties, at least 50 died in the attack. And many times that number are wounded. All available healers are seen to their care. Structural damage at least is limited, so essential business can be conducted without issue. Hmm. That said, the people are understandably shaken. We must assuage their fears and begin working to restore things to normal as quickly as possible. Now, the most confounding mystery remains our enemy. And their mechanical soldiers created with technology that surpasses anything I've ever seen. What is their nature? And how did Zoralja manage to bring them under his command? Such things remain unknown. They emerged from the dome encasing Yasolani. We're quite certain of that much. Uh, yeah. Speaking of the dome, we have some theories, I'm told. Yeah. Cryo? Indeed. I would like to call upon some helpers to join the discussion. May I invite them here? Helpers? By all means. Wait. New what? It's me. Permission has been granted. You can come in. Wait, 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 wait. Who's helping? Who is it? Greetings, everyone. Is that <gasps> Yes! It's the cat boy! <laughs> yes! It's cat mother! I mean, the Stola. Yo! Circumstances are quite dire. Yup. <laughs> Things are shit. <laughs> All is well in the annex, never fear. I've already dealt with the most pressing matters, and others hold the fort in my absence. Cool. Thanks, fellas. Changing of Dawn servants, Galul Jarja spoke about the Golden City to his two successors. Right. Thanks to Wuglamart, I was allowed to attend that meeting. What I heard led me to conclude that this was a matter for the students. Thus did I call upon our comrades who possess the requisite expertise. Nice. It was actually after that that the dome manifested. But, based on what we know, I have reason to believe that it is connected to the Golden City. While we're eager to help, we have limited familiarity with the situation. Might we trouble you to explain from the beginning? Story time! As you know, it was a letter I found tucked away in the Valdesian Annex that brought me to Tural. Yeah. But we saw him post Letter from the Dawn Servant, addressed to my grandfather, sent some 20 years ago. The request to investigate the City of Gold? Mm-hmm. Indeed. The strange thing is, there was mention of neither Tural nor the City in our records. Hoping to learn the truth of my grandfather's mission, what he did and saw, I volunteered to help in the right of succession. Yeah. At the end of which, I was able to hear the tale from Galul Jarjar. 
Yeah. Like us, my grandfather went to the deepest chamber of the sky deep cenote. And, like us, he saw the gate to the golden city. Right. Is that what you required our help with? This gate? It was. You see, the gate was opened once in the past. And... It led to another reflection. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Shit! I can take the story from here. Considering my part in these affairs, I reckon maybe I'm best equipped to speak on the matter. So we got the ninth. Re so solution case. nine is the ninth reflection. In those ruins, together with Galuf and Galul Jaja, and what I saw that day, I'll never forget. <laughs> Aaron Angie face, yeah. <laughs> Oh shit, echo time. <laughs> Aaron go. Ah! <laughs> oh, Ketten Ram looking solid. <laughs> this black is that? Is remarkable. Oh no, that's Gulf. <laughs> I cannot help but wonder. If the structures in this part of the ruins were built by a completely different civilization. It was over a thousand years ago that the giants mined here. Their records make no mention of glowing stones. Hmm. Wait, so how does... How does this pop up here? Oh wait, no, the layout of this room is different. It harbors high concentrations of ether, and on the surface are what appear to be arcane patterns. They aren't Alagam, or Mahi, or Minion. If anything, they put me in mind of the calculations of the South Sea Islanders, but even then, What? What did you do? <laughs> I didn't do it. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> yep, there it is. An earthquake? Oh, I'm fucking blind again. How many flashbangs is this game gonna have? None of these has ever happened before. Huh. A void gate? Hey, this is different. What, uh, 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 um, Lalafell, hi. How are we? Wait, is that? That uniform's familiar. <gasps> no! 
No! No fucking way! No. Baby? Now hold on. Why would you? Now what's this? So we need something what's similar this? to that. That Lullafell looks like he's got the fucking, um, what's it called? Garland Ironworks fit. Yeah, I immediately know who that baby is. That's fucking Kryle. Though it never opened again, Galif continued to study the gate for years after that, hoping to learn something of value. All he could conclude was that it was built with unknown technology, and that it led to another world, one apart from the Void. We'd assumed the ruins themselves were the Golden City, only to discover that the real prize actually lay beyond the gate and beyond our reach. Couldn't make head nor tail of the artifact either. Yep. As it had similar properties to the black stone in the ruins, we were convinced it was important. So Galul Jaja took it to the palace for safekeeping. Galif, meanwhile, took the baby with him back to Charlian and raised her as his own. Yup. Then the child was. Hey. How we doing? <laughs> the earring inside the letter to my grandfather. It was apparently found amongst my swaddling clothes. If this is true, then it means that you hail from another reflection. Which is fucking insane! <laughs> so it would seem. I still struggle to take it all in myself. How does that work? Looking back, Grandfather was always quick to seek distractions whenever I broached the subject. But never would I have guessed anything like this. But enough about me. We have more pressing matters. The forces that assailed Tuliolo. You suspect they are somehow connected to the Golden City? Yeah. Thinking back on it, the soldiers look like they could have been made from the same black stone. And leading them was Zeralja. His involvement also lends weight to the theory. On the day of the succession ceremony, a bandit took me unawares and knocked me out. When yep. I came to, I found my home turned upside down, with a few particular items missing. Namely the keystones I was entrusted with, for my role as Watcher of the Gate. 
the bandit. You believe that it was... Saru Jar Jar. I only got a glimpse of him, but I... was a blue-scaled Hubigo. Well, I know of no other. Yup. The artifact stored at the palace was also stolen. The thief struck during the ceremony, and the guard was spread thin. So our assumption is Zoran just somehow opened that gate to another reflection, where he acquired advanced technology and his mechanical armor. It fits. And if he did, then it's also likely that the dome is a product of this unknown reflection. <coughs> Hold on. We've been going on and on about the reflections, but what of my home? What's become of it? Oh, we don't know yet. <laughs> this looks like a job for the Sons of the Seventh Dawn. We're back! Indeed. Where it concerns other realities, I dare say the Scions are best suited to tackle the task. Damn straight. Rally the lads! You can say that again. We've been to the literal edge of existence. Some mysterious giant dome shouldn't scare us. As you know, our order has ostensibly disbanded. We'd thank you to be discreet about our unofficial reunion. Oh yeah, true, 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 true. Huh. Worry not. We'll spare no effort to get to the bottom of this. And with our hero, eager to help, you can be confident of the results. Mm -hmm. I'm coming with you. That's where my brother is, and that's where I must go. I can't say I understand everything you're discussing, but I know what I have to do. Yeah. I have to put a stop to Zoroja and restore the people's happiness. Suffice it to say, I share Lamachi's desire to join you. However, under these circumstances, it would be unwise for both vows to be absent from the city. That's fair. Juan's gonna stand such, point. I shall remain in Tuli Yolal. Fair enough. Come what may, I will protect our nation. So go forth, sister. And do what you must. Thank you. It may be prudent for us to likewise divide our forces. While one group ventures into the dome, the other keeps guard without. Agreed. Yep. There's something I wish to investigate out here. So I will remain. I as well. The enemy's you still wants to know I had a free travel. And I would see that we are prepared for the worst. I wish to go to the dome. As a student, I have an obligation to investigate this potential threat to the world. True. But I'd be lying if I said I'm not deathly curious about my origins. If there's aught to be learned, then I want to learn it. Fuck yeah, let's go. In that case, Please let me come too. Oh shit. I have to see what's become of my home. I may not be a fighter, but I know those lands like the back of my hand. I can guide you. Yeah, you say that, <laughs> but... If you hadn't offered, I would have asked. We're counting on you. Would it still be the same inside so the dome? The same to you, I'll join the dome crew. 
You should accompany them, Graha. I expect your knowledge and experience will be useful. In the meantime, I intend to learn what I can about the gate, and will keep you apprised of my findings. Pray do the same. Assuming communication is possible from inside the dome, we'll maintain contact and share any developments. It seems our teams are assembled. A fine roster, I think. Looks good to me. We'll find a way to deal with the threat. For the sake of Tural. It's truly heartening to have you at our side for this. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. I'm I'm still on the thought of um thing I need to do. Uh, people are still shaken by the attack, and I'd like to reassure them as best I can. Yeah. Yeah, I'm still on the thought of um you know, Aaronville going, I want to go with I would like to go with you. I know the way of my I know the lay of my homeland. So, please allow me to guide you. And then we go in and everything's just completely different because no one knows what's actually inside the dome. So it's completely different. He goes in and he just goes, "Oh. I don't know this." <laughs> I'm uh I'm going back. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> I know what I have to do now. Yeah. All right. Next up. I know we're in a hurry to set off, but before we do, I need to address my people. The peace we swore to uphold has been shattered. They need to understand what's happened and how we intend to fix it. So I want to call an assembly at the winged walk and assure them that all will be well. But as shaken as they are, I don't know how many will come. It's those who are most distressed that truly need to hear your words. If you like, I shall seek out such souls and encourage them to attend. I'll help too. This is an important step in the city's discovery. We're not in Kansas anymore. <laughs> Care to join us, Aaron? Shit, I will. While you handle that, Aaron, Aaronville and I will see to provisions for this expedition. Thank you. I'll go ahead and have the lands guard uh, announce the address. People must first know if there's going to be one before they can decide whether or not they want to hear it. If you could see to the resplendent court on Bayside Bevy, Alice and I will split the rest of the city between us. Okay. That's fair enough. Let's make it quick. It's not gonna be quick. I have to fucking run everywhere. Wee! <laughs> do, 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 do. Alright, good plot dump. Good plot dump. Um. I'm excited for what's ahead. Knowing that we're about to go to another reflection, pretty neat. Um, Ishtola, I think, has more game in this because she wants to go back to um, the first, but she can't. Um, so she's trying to learn as much by it and as much as possible, and I find that pretty neat. Um,. I do like the dynamic of Graha's inside the portal and Ishtola is on the other side. So they get to know what it's like for basically the two destinations. Because Graha's done realm travel. So I'm curious if... Actually, yeah, you know what? That's way more interesting. Because... Graha went into the um, Crystal Tower at the end of um, the Crystal Tower raids, didn't come out, and there was presumably a realm, uh, realm reflection travel that happened in the midst of that. So, unsure what's happened. There. So, like, He's gonna he's gonna have a comparison point. Meanwhile, my ass is sitting here with all the secrets like hey, I'm gonna use the Aetherite. <laughs> uh 
All right, where's this last person? They're probably... I really hope you're just sleeping. Yes, you're sleeping. Okay. Despairing alpaca herder. No! But yeah, also very curious that, um... What's it? Cryle is not from the source. That is a development that is... So far in. Also, if we consider, um... Oh, you know what? Because I haven't done the content. Um, I haven't done Baldessian Armory. I wonder what... Uh, okay? Thanks, Tara. Let me take that hydrate. Oh, I need a refill, but hang on. Just... <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Thank you for that, Tara. Hope we're doing well. Um, where was I going with this? I mean, we forgot. Yeah, I haven't done Beldesian Armory, so I'm wondering if I had done that content. Um, what does that mean for the reflection stuff? And probably more importantly, does does Ozma? Um, I think it was called, uh, uh, have any bearing on, on this expansion. Because that was basically, like, Dimension Sphere Cube thing. Yeah. So while we may not be seeing that in my playthrough, I'm very curious if it has any um, uh, bearing on any of this. Um... But I do also still want to know, um, do we get the lads? Do we get our lads Alpha No and, Al uh, not Alpha No, say, uh, Uriange and Thancred? Because, like, we should. I mean, if this is the reunion of the Scions, then I really hope that they come back. I do also appreciate the, um, <laughs> that they retired for one expansion, um, like disbanded, and then immediately in the next expansion, it's just like, all right, fuck it. So much for that idea. We're back. We can't make it official, but you know what? It's, we need it. <laughs> So yeah, this expansion turned from fun and games to, hey, guess what? Um, dude has access to the Imperial Army. Let's get the band back together, you know? Good trip this is so far. And what, we're at level 96? Maybe a dungeon soon? I don't know. Curious who there might be. It looks like you've brought quite a few people. Thank you. Alice had actually returned ahead of you, but upon hearing that you were still out there, she decided she was unsatisfied with her own efforts and left again. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
I like that. <laughs> That's good. But my apologies in involving you all in Torelli affairs. We are simply helping dear friends in need. Having traveled the lands of Turel, sharing the, in the rich cultures of your people, I can see it's no other way. What's more, Zuralja and his army pose a threat not only to Turel, but to the star as a whole. We will stand with you to protect what you hold dear. Mm-hmm. Thank you. I don't expect you've had much, if any, rest. How are you holding up? I'm fine. Thanks to the encouragement from Mayron. Oh, shucks. <laughs> you needn't worry about me either. Whatever weariness I feel is no match for my desire to protect my people. We will restore peace to the nation and preserve our father's legacy. And it begins by speaking to the people from our hearts. Right. We need to see a few things first, but feel free to go ahead to the plaza and wait. Okay. Their father raised them well. That he did. Actually, you know what? This is a good point as to if we can't charge Aether into the machines, how is, uh... Oh, no, is Shola stay on this side? Okay, yeah, you know what? <laughs> this, day, this then makes more sense. Spot the anime characters. <laughs> hmm. Lamachi, are you all right? It's more voiced cutscenes. Yes. Don't worry. I'm ready for it. The fear, and sadness, and anger. Everything. I am the reason to your resolve. But more than that, I am your brother. You needn't bear this burden alone. Remember this. You can do it. As you likely already know, my father, our former Dawn servant, lost his life in the recent attack. <laughs> He challenged the enemy leader to a duel, and fought with skill and valor. And for a moment, we believed he had won. But wielding an unknown power, his foe returned from death and struck him down. I could only watch as this happened. I could not tarnish my father's honor by interfering. Many of you have suffered terribly. You've taken wounds. You've lost friends and family. As vow of resolve, I failed in my duty to protect you. Words can't express the shame and regret I feel. And as much as it pains me to reveal this, the enemy leader was none other 
than my brother Zorolcha. Zorolcha? It's true! I saw him! We believe he staged the attack from Yasulani, which has been encased within a mysterious dome. I know that you're concerned for your loved ones there as well. But mark my words, I won't let Zorolja torment us any further. Our father gave his life to protect our nation, and I'm prepared to do the same. You say that, but those metal monstrosities are still up there in the sky. What are you going to do about them? Whoop they ass. <laughs> The enemy is still on our doorstep, and waiting for them to strike again accomplishes nothing. That's why we're going to strike first. We are going to take the battle straight <laughs> Somebody to get me a big and stick. put an end to it all. And while my sister sallies forth, I will take charge of the city's defenses. Not another soul will come to harm. We swear to you. Bet. Like our father before us, we will lead with resolve and reason to restore peace to our nation. So please, have patience and faith. Yeah. <laughs> so the resolve goes on the attack, while reason shores up the defenses. Sounds like a fine plan. Yes! <laughs> Needless to say, you can count on my sword. Dural's my home, and I'll do my part for it. Baku Jaja, the homeboy! <laughs> here, here, brother. Sorry, the homeboys. Two of us. Uh, or was that two of we? Ah, uh, never mind that. What of the rest of you? Will you let others do the work? Or will you do your part and fight? <laughs> we fight! We fight! We're two Leolins because we're united! We'll stand with you and weather this storm! He's right. This is our nation and it falls to us to protect it. Yeah! We'll fight too, for Duliola. Me too, me too. We're all together in this. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. We've already learned much about our foe, and we will continue to learn more. In time, we will have the means to make their warships fall from the sky. When we join hands with our countrymen and our allies from afar, we're stronger than we dare to hope. Together, let us show the enemy the might of Tuli Yolal. Oh wow, some of those animations animations froze. <laughs> you are the beating heart of our nation. Each and every one of you. Mm -hmm. Uncertain days lie ahead. But for now, I ask you to persevere. To go about your lives as you always do. Only then can we ensure we have the resources to see our nation through these trials. 
Uh, we should have two left. And when the time comes, we will strike. Tuliyola will not fall. We will prevail, and peace and happiness will be ours again. Oh man, some of those animations aren't playing. That's unfortunate. Still a hype scene. Hell yeah. Listening to Wook, Lamat, and Kwana. I was reminded of my time in the first. While the Exarch was no king, I often found myself speaking before the people of the Crystarium in like manner. And through their deeds, they answered me. The people of Tural, too, will rise to the occasion. This I can tell. Man, Graha's like, I've seen this all before. It's good, though. <laughs> well, the hour of departure is at hand. Those of us remaining here shall accompany you part of the way. I, for one, would like to see the dome firsthand. We set forth as soon as everyone is ready. I will inform Wuklamat that... There you all are! Ah, Lamati! We were just planning, on calling, uh, planning to call you. Are you ready to leave? I am. Seeing the people to come together as one, knowing they haven't given up hope yet. It was... it was all the encouragement I could ask for. Hell yeah. Right then, let's get going. We leave from the Zaktural Skygate. Mm-hmm. Man, I look nervous. <laughs> Sectoral Skygate. Not there. Uh, up there. Wait. There. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> you shitting? <laughs> like, <laughs> just, I'll listen to this convo. I'm trying to hold it in. Hold one in. Oh, it's coming. <laughs> Help. <laughs> cuck -dub. No, not cuck W. What do you mean, cuck W? Everyone's here? Good. This is it, my friends. We go to strike down Zoralja and secure peace for Tuliola. We'll be passing through Shaloani, where there have been reports of enemy movement. So stay sharp. Okie dokie. Are we immediately taken to the right spot or... Yeah, this music. Oh, the ships are here as well. Okay. The Landscar told, had told me about them. They emerged from the dome in quick succession and took to looming overhead. A display of force, like the vessels in Tuliolo. Indeed, and while they haven't taken any aggressive actions, I want to s I want to see how things are in the area before moving on. We'll be passing a few settlements on the way to Shaoani Station. It's the perfect opportunity to look around. In that case, Aaron and I know a few locals who can help. Mm, yeah, we do. Then let's divide into two groups. Erinville, Alice A, and Aaron will come with me to inquire to the locals. Meanwhile, the rest of you can go and inspect the dome. That's a fair call. Understood. Once everyone is finished, let us reconvene at Shaloani Station. Done deal. 
We can start with Husata Husatawi. That's where the Dust Watch is based, if I remember correctly. You do. The the Sheriff Kema Kemaka should be able to tell us a few things. Yep. Let's go. I wish I had flown in this area. Oh, I've still got the hunt marks. Oh, I need to tell chat about, um, <laughs> on my way, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> He's coming. Uh, <laughs> I just saw him log in. <laughs> oh, I need to tell you guys, uh, about this motherfucker. Mi 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 mis Mr. Kaithalas, everybody. So, I need to tell you guys about the hunt marks in this game and how I'm not doing them. There's a reason why I'm not doing them. I'll, I'll, I'll show you immediately why I'm not doing them. Immediately, I can't do the content. I'm not doing this content. I'm not hunting alpacas. That is not okay. I do not, I do not want to do that. So, then what happened, right? I was partied up with, uh, I was partied with Kakalos, uh, Will. We, we, we know him as Will at this point. Um, so I was partied up with Will. And I was like, I don't want to hunt the alpacas. We're going to do all the other ones. We're not going to hunt alpacas. I'm like, and he's like, yep, okay, all good. Sweet. Uh, and we're middle of doing roulettes. And, you know, I was just sort of messing around, getting my eighth occurrence in the area. Will goes to hunt the alpacas. And I get alpaca fillets in my inventory. I was so distraught. I was actually really upset. I, <laughs> oh, fuck you, waiting here. <laughs> hey, buddy. <laughs> Look at him. Culprit. Oh shit, that's auto walk. Culprit! What do you have to say for yourself? Hmm? Don't look here! <laughs> <laughs> you can't just kick up dust. Cruelty. Hanged. Hanged. Yes. You. You. <laughs> Don't look deep. <laughs> Go there. All right. <laughs> I'll clip that later. <laughs> oh, it's you two. And I'll be Val Wook Lamat as well. You're Sheriff of the Dust Watch, yes? What's the situation here in, in uh, Husatawi? <laughs> Don't know if my friend was the one that killed them. The mate just appeared on my person. We'll hold them in a court of law. <gasps> what are you? <laughs> a? No, it won't. B? <laughs> That's just how the game gave it to me. I gave them back to Will. They're his. <laughs> They're not mine. I don't know why I appeared in my inventory. I didn't even kill it. <laughs> Tell it to the judge. Oh, fuck. All right, well. GG then. <laughs> well, the enemy is, hasn't tried to pick a fight with us yet. The ships gave us a shock when they first appeared, but they've been s just been floating there, holding position. Sold each for two thousand gil two thousand gil on market board. Not worth. Well, <laughs> just don't kill him. <laughs> That's it. I received some uncertain reports from elsewhere. We've been investigating to the extent that we can, but we're spread thin and haven't looked in on Shishawezi Springs yet. Apparently, mechanical soldiers were seen in the vicinity. What? 
if this is true, then the people are there in the danger. I'll, I worry about the other townships as well. If the rest of you could head to the springs, I'll pay the pay a visit to Mahoetzan. I'll accompany Erinville. See you all in a while. Makes sense. I bet. Uh, yes! Nope, that's examined. Ride pillion. Huzzah! Alright, where are we going again? Uh, ah. Uh. Well, I know you're flying us, but. <laughs> Let's, uh. Let's take the quick route. <laughs> I see the teleport request takes you there, doesn't it? And clear all this way. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> the mechanical soldiers don't be don't seem to be in this area. Still, we should talk to the locals. Let's make rounds and see what we can learn. Okie dokie. Making the rounds. Oh, you're the one that helped us from the other day. While Lika and the others are out investigating, and they've confirmed that not a weak, weak way is safe. It was after the train had begun its journey back here that the dome appeared. So those who are riding the train then are fine, but we don't know what's become of those who disembarked in Yustalani. <sighs> what a mess. And just after we finished fixing the tracks. He sees unfortunate, yes. Alright, uh where the fuck oh. Oh god damn it. <laughs> there we go. Mechanical soldier! Hi buddy! The mechanical soldier the soldiers shows no sign of life. It appears to be run through with a palm. <gasps> Cliff Air runs your play. <laughs> the wheel is mad. <laughs> nice. Aaron, you came. As you can see, we're doing all right. After those ships appeared in the sky, soldiers clad in white showed up and surrounded the town. But to our surprise and relief, a traveler came along and dealt with them all in a flash. I'll never forget the way he soared through the air, spear in hand. Shaman never had the chance to ask his name. Uh, his name's Estinian. Estinian Wormblood, the fan name. Uh, he had a different name. Uh, contrary to popular belief. <laughs> We're all safe thanks to him. But I can't say the same for those in Yusalani. We haven't heard from anyone there. I hope Namika is doing well. <laughs> it's just slowly going through town. I appreciate you. Well, I appreciate you filling out time. Just fucking around. <laughs> You heard about that the spearman as well? That couldn't be anyone. <laughs> Gotta do something fair. What's this? Someone's spreading more gossip about me. Right. You. <laughs> as soon as just next to him. <laughs> Talk of how I saved the town travels fast. Ah. Jesus, that was a bad laugh. <laughs> Sorry about that. That's not to discount the help of my friend here, of course. We gave those machines a real beating. I thought you'd come sooner or later. Do you know what's happening? So you were indeed the one helping keep people safe. Thank you. Think nothing of it. The automata aren't particularly strong. Wow. Wow. You are saying that to the person who just had their, like, community decimated. That's fucked. 
But all the rumored true. Gulu Jaja is slain. I'm afraid so. Zorelja did use some dirty trick to get the better of him. We'll make him pay for what he's done. Mark my words. You're going to help her, I assume? <laughs> Fuck yeah, you know me? <laughs> I see. <laughs> Without your contingent, you won't lack for strength. In which case, I'll remember Shalani to, and keep an eye on things. That helps us more than you know. I'll send word to my brother before we set off. If you find yourself in trouble, do not hesitate to contact Koana. Koana? Brother? Wait a second, you're the Vow of Resolve? I am, and you're Zakawa, right? I'll be counting on you to keep everyone here safe. Absolutely. If any more of those holy men show up, I'll send them packing. I'm the fastest of going to Shalani, after all. Aaron can attest to that. Well. <laughs> Glad to hear it. We'll leave Shalani in your capable hands. Let's get patrolling right away, then. Aaron, help. <laughs> Stay safe out there. And don't do anything reckless. Wasted words, eh? Just do what comes naturally. <laughs> yeah, I will. You too, buddy. See you in the Akmorn, buddy. Right then. It's time we headed to the station and join the others. Uh, alright. I think that's my ride. <laughs> uh, I'll sit in the back. <laughs> Let's ride! It's okay. Tra train station, sir. Hells yeah. I got the cab. This motherfucker is not have his feet on the gas pedal. Any any in-air refreshments, sir? Um, no, I think I'm alright. It's a short ride. Slowly landing on the- Aw, oh, the train tracks! <laughs> it guys respect your uber um he is about he is fair um and you're looking a little thirsty buddy pleasure <laughs> fellas always 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 tip your drivers good doing business with you fuck I'm okay as well. Pledge. Thanks to Istinian, there were no casualties to speak of in Shalawani. The Hetsaro were safe as well. At the very least, there were no signs of soldiers there. What about the dome? Did you learn anything or not? It is composed of exceedingly high concentrations of lightning energy. To even touch the barrier would prove fatal. When approaching it, we must exercise all caution. Then how are we supposed to get inside? If Zoralja and his army uh, emerge from within, there ought to be an entrance. An entrance, you say? So it happens that we might just have an inkling where one is. I keep forgetting to put on the fucking Texan accent. I keep going for British. These are the engineers of Zaktural Railing, which operates the train between Shalawani and Yusalani. When we went to help, when we went out to recover the train, we had a look at the dome f through a telescope. It was then that we saw it. 
a, a large fortress-like structure that looked like it straddled the dome's edge. You're telling us it part of it is inside and part of it outside? It seemed, that seemed to be the case, yes. While we only observed it from afar, the soldiers were coming and going from it. From that, I'd say it serves as a passage between the outside world and whatever's inside. But as you'd expect, the, every, the area was heavily defended. It won't be easy to get near. Do you know what became of the passengers who went to Yasolani? Wuklamat's nursemaid was among them, a woman named Namika. What? I'm afraid not. The only passengers who were headed back to here were accounted account for. Ooh, one second. I'm gonna snooze the ads. Oh shit, I didn't read that. When a big tremor struck not far from after we left the station, I hit the emergency brakes uh, and looked back. And all I could see was the dome. What's more, the fortress sits right on the tracks of all the places. What are the odds of that, huh? Assuming this fortress serves as a means to pass through the dome, we should first determine how, how we're to reach it unattended. Undetected, sorry. I don't get a photo detected. I say we smash our way inside. Despite how it sounds, I actually gave this some thought. Zuralja wants me to prove that I'm father's worthy successor. If I fail, he'll destroy Tuhuloyola. By charging in head on, I make my intentions plain as day, and in so doing, keeps his eyes on me. A bold strategy. I like it. Of course, your plan will be no good if you're cut down before reaching their base. What you need is something to get you th get you there quick and break through their defenses in a single decisive blow. And we have just that. Since the tracks go straight to the fortress, we can reinforce our train with armor, load her with all the fuel she can carry, and set her hurtling at it to explode on impact. Um... Yeah? Chief, have you gone insane? Batshit even? <laughs> you were just saying you're relieved for the trains in one piece, and now you want to turn it into a bomb? The train's not important. Our dream is to have a railroad running from coast to coast, remember? If these invaders have their way, there may not be any more railroads, let alone trains to run on them. Is that what you want? I'm gonna hit you if you say no. <laughs> it's a sacrifice we'll have to make. These good folks are willing to put their lives on the line to get inside the dome and put a stop to all this. The least we can do is help them. But, but Chief. I gotta snooze the ads again. It keeps letting me know. Listen, no matter how hard things may get, no matter how many times we fa fall, we can always get back up. As long as we're alive, we can always build another train. So have faith, and quit your complaining. But what if we fall really, really hard? There's no getting back up if we're dead. No one's dying on this train. I'll see to it myself. Hey. Needless to say, this will be a one-way trip, so we'll need to jump off at the last moment if we don't want to go out in a blaze of glory. You all right with that? I might be. There's no change in your, her mind, is there? Just promise you'll be careful out there, honey. No.
We'll keep your wife safe, we promise. I'll hold you to it. Can't start a family business without her, much less a family. It'd be a lie to say that the loss of the train doesn't concern me. But with good friends and my loving wife beside me, that's all I really need in the end. Oh. Well, at least she'll go down as the legendary train to save Turrell. That it will. But first, we got work to do so she'll look the part. Yeah! <laughs> I don't know what to do here. I don't know much about Magitech, but if there's anything I can do to help, you need but say the word. We'll keep that in mind. If any of you are willing to and able to lend a hand, there's work that needs doing over at the storehouse. It seems we have a path forward. I believe this is a good time for me to t return to Tulhyolal and inform Koan of the situation. I shall return as well. I have new investigations to pursue. Huh? The dome's elemental aspect is similar to that of the gate in the Golden City. If we can identify a connection, we may learn something of use in our fight. It's one mystery after the next. But at least we're not without clues. It may not be easy, but I know we can get through this together. And thus... Even only having just met them, I can see how the train is to... How, how important the train is to Wawlik and the engineers. We can't let their sacrifice be for nothing. And complete quest. Alright. It is 10.30. I need to start getting ready for bed. Unfortunately, we are close to solution 9. Yes. But we're going to save that for the next stream. Um... Good stuff all around. Uh, I am enjoying how this plot is developing yet again. <laughs> um, very intriguing how this. Very intriguing how this is going. Um, so yeah, next stream will once again be this, uh, and it'll be on Wednesday. And I'm presuming we're going to be heading into Solution Nine. Um which we know from like announcement trailers and stuff like that. We're going to be heading into solution nine. I'm assuming next stream. Uh, next stream should be at the usual time. I'd start at 8.30 today because I had to organize a few things. Um, but yeah, we should be in for it then. Um, so that's going to be all. Uh, but in the meantime, let's look for uh, someone to raid. Uh, if anyone has anyone they would like us to raid, please shout it out. Uh, otherwise, I'm going to go looking. Let's see. Um, this might be a good watch. Yeah, okay, let's do this one. All right. Um, so, person that we are about to raid. Uh, we are raiding once again, Majin Tatsu, who is. I keep forgetting, unfortunately. What's the actual. Uh, 
uh, I think Elf Dragon Vampire VTuber. Um, they are currently playing PAX Day, which seems to be like a little survival craft um, game. Looks pretty neat. Um, so we're going to be watching them. Let's rate them out. Slash raid margin tatsu. Uh, but yeah, from the streams that I've seen, from the streams that I've seen of them, uh, very chill, very chill. Um, so good to be rating them again. Good for good for a wind down. Um, yeah, we'll be missing the ads. So yeah, once again, thank you guys for coming along. I very much appreciate y'all. To those lurking in chat, also thank you very much. I appreciate having y'all here as well. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, please do be sure to leave a follow. I'd be very much appreciative of your support. Um, drink your water. It's always good for you. Uh, I'm very thirsty. I need a refill. And I will catch y'all on Wednesday. Have a good night, y'all. Catches.